finally hearing what the Chiefs highest paid player Dwayne Bowe has to say after being arrested. Uh, in a statement he said quote I apologize to the Hunt family coach Reed my teammates and Chiefs fans for the distraction. Shannon Halligan heard from all of them. She tells us what they had to say. Shannon. Well, we're here with 810 Sports Radio outside of Tickets for Less, and everyone who's been coming in here and calling in have been talking about what? Well, Dwayne Bowe and the trouble he's in, and is it going to hurt the Chiefs when they play the Broncos Sunday night? That's pretty much it. Dwayne Bowe. Dwayne Bowe is the talk of the town. Jim waiting patiently. You're in the program, Jim. What's going on? Well, I hope I can speak for a lot of people that are fans here that uh, for as many reasons as Dwayne has let us down, I think that Andy Reid has shown us some things to be proud of. Calls came flooding into 810 Sports Radio with remarks about Bo. Because I almost feel like the real Dwayne Bo is the guy who's who maybe wants more balls, but will keep his mouth shut because they're winning. He'll do what it takes to win games. This after Bo was arrested and charged with possession of marijuana during the Chiefs' bye week and a week before the biggest game of the year. I'm sure the question will come up about uh, the Dwayne part being a distraction. I think this football team's uh, uh, focused in on the Denver Broncos and solely on the Denver Broncos. And Most people around the country are talking about what these charges could mean for the wide receiver, but teammates wouldn't say much. You know, it's, it's legal matter, so we, we just want him that process to take care of itself and let the league take care of, take care of itself. And And Dwayne Bowe's attorney did release a statement today in which he said that Bo is 100% innocent. Live in Overland Park, Shannon Halligan, 41 Action News.